this stadium as they sit there eating their burgers and drinking their drinks. They're just hoping it's going to continue. What is up, guys? Welcome back to the second half of Terminator vs. Kareem Karim, I think his name is. Uh, if you missed the first half, there's a link in the description to it, but I'm 2 1 up. Although, if you looked at the, the half time stats, you wouldn't believe that. I've had two shots on target, scored both of them. This guy has had 12 shots, of which five were on target, and he's just got the solitary goal. The staff cow's in here, uh, actually, he's outside. But if, you've, if you did see the first half, you'll see that he's basically just shooting from long range, and you know, I'm quite happy for him to do that because my goalkeeper is just gobbling them all up all day. Now Messi. Messi is in. Can he beat the last man? He does. And the guy has paused the game. Oh. So is he going to change his tactics? Or not? Well, anyway, guys, I'm just going to skip ahead until the game restarts. So I'll see you in a minute. Good piece of and we're back now, guys. Uh, not sure what he did. I'm sure we'll find out now. He's making a change. So he's bringing Gareth Bale on. Why you got him on the bench in the first place is puzzling in itself. But either way, I am attacking and in a dangerous position. And Messi trying to do too much, has lost the ball. Again, this guy also likes to attack in numbers. He's committing a lot of men forward. Bale tries to take on the entire team and has missed the chance to score. I was, I, I was literally going ready to throw my control back then, guys. As soon as he brought him on, he scores. Well, why don't we start him? Again, because he's committing so many men forward, there is a lot of space up this end of the pitch. I mean, look at the space Oxley Chamberlain's got there. It's just a shame his passing needs a bit of work. No doubt it's going to be another attack here. But that's if Paulinho actually doesn't win it first, which he does. Balcao trying to play in Messi, finds Messi. Messi's still going. And Messi with a goal. How did that end up in the net? I don't know, because there was at least three instances there where he was tackled, but he actually won the ball back on the rebound. And Messi gives a lecture to the team in celebration. So I lost it there, but rebounds. Lost it there, rebounds. And then he beats the keeper. <laughs> I'm going to take it, I'm not going to complain. That's 3 1. How I'm 3 1 up is beyond me. I just played a brilliant counter attack in style. Maybe the guy will learn in the future, you know, if you commit so many men forward, you need to have adequate protection at the back because all my goals have just been from long through balls. You know, you can show off all you want, mate. You're 3 1 down. And you're shooting from long range again. I'm happy for you to do that all day long. I've had three shots on target, I've scored three goals. You've had about 18 shots, albeit most of them from distance, and you three one down. Balk out. Finds Danny. Danny finds Messi. Messi's played in Paulinho, who is ahead of the last man. And he wins a corner. I'm going to confuse him a bit. I will call Vidic over. He brings a guy forward. Not many guys in the box. Carlino's corner. And that's going to go for a throw in to myself. What? 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 That is my ball. Ah, fine, fine. One touch passing off on the spice. He's getting a bit desperate now. He's, he's, he's going for balls that aren't high. Paulinho, Messi, getting lagging a bit. Danny plays in Messi. Messi one way down the other. Falk out. No. Melo. No. Somehow he's got the ball away. I like the one-touch passing he was doing to play the ball upfield. It's just a shame he's not actually doing much better than he is because he does brilliant link-up play like that and then he shoots from long range. Clearly he's got an offensive mentality because I'm just getting in behind his defence every time. So Paulino wins a free kick. Referee not going to do anything. 
So what can Messi do here? The guy's clearly going to show me some respect because he's putting the defender on the near post. But we'll, we'll try anyway, see what we can do. And as it turns out, it was a good thing to put him there because he's actually just blocked the goal. So I'm going to change things around again. He hasn't committed the man forward, but as it's Lionel Messi, I'll give him the ball anyway. Doesn't do much of a shot, but I've won it back. And the referee thinks that was a foul. What a joke. Style, but I'll put the guy there. You know, if you lose the ball now, mate, you're going to be in trouble. Which you have done. And now Paulinho's in. Take your finger off the spin button, Terminator. What can Falcao do? And that should be game set and match now, guys. 4 1 up. Falcao gets his goal. Need a second chance to do it. I wonder now if the guy's actually going to finish the game off. He's just going to rage quit. Goalkeeper really should have done better with that, really. Anyway, Falcao gets his second of the match, I think. And what's he going to do? Well, he is going to carry on. And his show off attempt fails again. What can Paulinho do here? Look at again the space for Oxley Chamber. Good brings his keeper out. But they do win the ball back and he's gonna play it away. And this cross is cleared by Vidic. Paulinho finds Danny. Danny finds Messi. Oh and he's actually in. He's actually in now. With a chance, and he's offside. That was a very late call. I would be hard. I would be feeling hard done by if I was him. Yeah, I mean, I, I was thinking when I went one 0 down in this game that I was uh, in for a right rollick in the, especially the way he played. But remember, I told you guys at the start of the game how uh, when he was just charging my team down, he would wear himself out. And clearly, that's uh, shown. This Falcao now is in for a hat trick. Doesn't quite get it. Yeah, I mean, the first 20 minutes, he was all over me. He was closing me down. He was pressing me really high up the pitch. And when he went 1-0 up, you know, I'm sure he thought he was uh, in for a good win. But I've played guys like that before. I know that, you know, that, that kind of relentless pressure can't last. And he's given me a chance by leaving his defence exposed. And I've hit him on the break three times. 4-1 up. I mean, credit to the guy, he's actually going to finish the match, so, you know, he's not, he's not a sore loser or anything like that. I mean, I've enjoyed this game, I don't, I, I'm sure it's not the same for him, but it's definitely not been a 4-1 game. He's made mistakes and I've punished him. There may be another one right now, because the Ox is in again. Wins the corner. Does he bring a guy forward this time? He is, so I'll just rip cross it. Can anyone get a goal? Too close to the goalkeeper. Long kick up field. We are now in injury time. There's nobody here. So I'll see if I can just try and show off a bit now. See if I can score while I call an Arsenal goal. Okay. Paulinho. I think he was offside. He was. So, this should wrap the game up now. He shouldn't have time to bring it upfield. He doesn't. So, that's the final whistle. I've won four goals to one. Two from Falcao. Uh, one from the Ox. And the other goal was a Lionel Messi goal. So, I'm quite happy with that. Uh, I'm going to wrap it up there, guys. If you've enjoyed this, by all means, give smash that like button. Leave a comment. I do appreciate the feedback. Uh, if you'd like to challenge me yourself, you can do that. My PSN details will be in the description. Just drop me a message. Uh, and I'll just leave it there, guys. So uh, take care. I'll speak soon.